Motor Week is made possible by TireRack.com, Hum by Verizon, RockAuto.com, State Farm, AutoTempest.com, and WeatherTech. The Geneva International Motor Show is known for its cool concepts and premium priced cars, and this year both made for a lot of electricity. The production version of the all-electric Jaguar I-PACE made its show debut. This Tesla-fighting SUV arrives here later this year. Bentley's first step towards electrification is the Bentayga plug-in hybrid. Volkswagen's ID Vision electric sedan concept is also fully autonomous. Audi's camouflaged all-electric e-tron prototype SUV could launch in Europe this year. They also showed their new A6 midsize sedan. Hyundai brought the new Kona Electric and hinted at future designs with the Le Fil Rouge concept. Porsche's vision for EVs is the 600 horsepower Mission E-Cross Turismo concept. On the other hand, the traditionally powered non-turbo Porsche 911 GT3 RS rates 520 HP. Mercedes-Benz is adding the four-door Mercedes-AMG GT Coupe to the lineup, along with a more outrageous 585 HP Mercedes-AMG G63. The lighter and longer BMW X4 bowed in Geneva, along with the BMW Concept M8 Grand Coupe. 557 horses haul this two-door Range Rover SV Coupe. Volvo adds their latest family cues and tech to a new V60 midsize wagon. Room to Rome inspired the Subaru Visiv Tourer concept. The tiny Lexus UX is the brand's smallest luxury crossover yet. While parent Toyota confirmed the Supra's return with this GR Supra racing concept. The track-only McLaren Senna GTR concept joined the new 800 horsepower McLaren Senna. The track-focused Aston Martin Valkyrie AMR Pro Hypercar made its world debut along with the Lagonda Vision concept and the new Aston Martin Vantage. Bugatti made the Chiron Sport lighter and faster. Italian flair came with the Ferrari 488 Pista, while rival Lamborghini dropped the top on the Huracan Performante Spider. And those are Geneva's automotive highlights for this week's Motor News.